on behalf of my, of my uh, colleagues, uh, Joshua Gans, Avi Goldfarb, uh, Catherine Tucker, uh, welcome everybody to Toronto for the second annual NBER conference on the economics of artificial intelligence. I just want to begin by uh, thanking the uh, groups that supported this conference, uh, which is the Sloan Foundation, uh, the Canadian Institute for Advanced Research, uh, and the Creative Destruction Lab. And just as a historical note, you may, uh, some people will be familiar, but others might find interesting, uh, that the Canadian Institute for Advanced Research uh, has been supporting this line of inquiry uh, in a variety of forms for quite a long time. And so for over a couple of decades, they've been supporting on the computer science side uh, research in machine learning far before it was a, a topical and fashionable thing. And many of the early pioneering work that was done in Toronto, Montreal, and Edmonton in particular uh, was funded uh, through their organization. And in terms of Toronto and just the historical significance of having this conference here, uh, some of you will know, but some, some will find interesting that uh, many of the people that lead the machine learning groups at some of the most influential industrial uh, AI centers uh, came from Toronto. Uh, so the, for example, the, the person who leads the AI group, uh, founded the AI research group at Facebook, Yann LeCun, 10 years ago, Toronto. A person who uh, leads the uh, AI for Apple, uh, 10 years ago, Toronto, uh, Russell Kudinov. A person who leads AI for Elon Musk's $1 billion Open AI Institute, 10 years ago, Toronto, uh, Ilya Suskiver. A person who leads AI at Tesla, uh, uh, Andre Karpak, uh, 10 years ago, Toronto. Of course, uh, Jeff Hinton. Uh, at Google, uh, still at Toronto. Uh, so there's a, a lineage for many of these groups that trace back here. Uh, so with that, 